else in this room would really be upset if this uh, ended up being the use that was, and I understand you need to consider, and I understand you've got a, an issue with the a budget from the town, um, but I just can't imagine a worse use in that neighborhood, surrounded on three sides by conservation land, and a neighborhood just to the north than a solid waste treatment plant uh, with 40 trucks coming in and pumping out methane gas. Um, and it just, it seems like you know, spending any extra money or time on it, just, I just don't get it. Um, so we just want, we're all here because we want you to know that we're really not happy about this even being on the final list. Um, I can also say, putting on a different hat, I sit on the facilities committee at Belmont Hill School. Um, we are looking to, uh, for places, and I know Mr. Brownell is here from Belmont Hill School. I, I, I don't know if you've been talking to Belmont Hill or not, and I haven't heard anything about it as, my, as a member of the, of the facilities committee. I think it'd be worth at least having a conversation with them to see if they'd be willing to spend some money. I think that they probably would um, uh, to help investigate some of the uses, and I think you know they'd be very interested in having a, a hockey rink close by that they could share with the town. Yeah, that's an excellent idea. Actually, yeah. Um, like, uh, sure. um, yeah, we got the petition from the neighborhood multi for the record multi page multi signed mm -hmm. considerably against the anaerobic digester. We we understand the neighborhood's position on it. We have been running all of these down. We, like I said, we have a we have a matrix with all these different criteria that sort of, ob we're trying to objectively just look at the ideas and then we're drilling down into the remaining five and this is sort of the drill down into the anaerobic digester idea. It, in my mind, the answer wasn't as glowing as I expected it to be, so you know, I don't know whether this is any more viable an option, but um, we're gonna have to make a decision, as I said, before May as to what we're gonna do with the incinerator site because then we have to cap it. So, uh, but I, I appreciate your concern. And I understand. And what you touched by people at the at Hill School there. It's no, the great news is I guess tell Patrice that our town administrator the information that'd be fantastic. Thank okay, you. thank you. Thank you. <laughs>